Hi, everyone. This is Dustin from yourwebsiteengineer.com, and uh, I'm going to answer a question today that I've gotten actually quite a few times people have, have brought this to my attention, and they want to know, can you have more than one blog on your WordPress website? And the answer is no. You can only have one blog. That's the way WordPress works. However, you can trick your users into thinking that you have more than one blog. So right now I am showing you a live look at my demo site and I've just put this together to put together some tutorials and to show you exactly how you can do different sorts of things. So my homepage I have set up as the the entire blog. So as you can see I've got two posts. The first two posts here are posted in test and um, you can see that right here. And then the next two are posts that are posted in Dustin. You can see that right there. And the last one is just the default um, post by WordPress and it's put in the uncategorized position. You can see that I have what it looks like one blog, but it's got all these different categories. So how are we gonna go about doing this? If you go to your dashboard, you can see I still got five posts and I'm using three different categories. So what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna put tabs or menu items to direct them directly to a category. So instead of people clicking on the blog, you say for instance your 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 site set up to go to blog, instead of going to blog and getting all your content, maybe you have a section that you want to be newsletters or maybe you have a section that you want podcasts. You can all do this um, for exactly the way that I'm going to show you. So if you go and click the down arrow under appearance and then go to menus, Okay, so I'm not using the custom menus for WordPress, so we want to go ahead and set that up real quick. I normally call this main menu and uh, just go ahead and create that menu. The menus have been successfully created. Now you want to put that primary navigation as main menu and click save. And then you want to bring menu items to your menu. So I only have one page on my site, so I'm going to go ahead and add that to the menu. And then I'm also going to link the home page right here as part of the menu structure as well. So we'll call that home and we will put that in demo.yourwebsiteengineer.com. We'll add that to the menu. If you've never used the menu structure, it's really pretty neat. You can just drag and drop and put things exactly where you want. Okay, but now we want to have, we want to show that we have two different blogs. So I'm going to add the two different categories that I want to show that I have two different blogs for. So I go ahead and add test the test category and the Dustin category, and I'm going to click add to menu. So now those three, four items should appear on the menu. You click save and we'll go back to the demo site and I'll show you exactly what that looks like. Click refresh. Okay, so now we're at the home page, and as you can see, the home page looks identical to what it did. These are all the blog posts, so this is this is like the entire blog is under home. But if we go to test, there should only be two categories in here, and there are two different posts. And there are the one ca one post is number two, and one is number one. And if you go to Dustin, you can click there, and you can get post number two and post number one. So you can go ahead and you can set up these different categories. If you want to have like a podcasting section and a blog section, and you want them to appear completely different, that's what you need to do to go ahead and make it look like you're using two different blogs when in reality you're only using one. I'm Dustin Hartzler at yourwebsiteengineer.com.